okay, 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 okay. So back in 2018, I made my college thesis film, and the premise was that it was a game show hosted by the devil, and it was on this public access TV channel called OPB TV, a cult public broadcast television. And ever since I made that film, I've just been making little snippets of content for that like cinematic universe, that channel, right? And I've been taking a lot of inspiration from analog horror, like Local 58, which if you don't know what that is, you should check it out. It's so cool. But they make videos so slowly. So anyway, today I thought it would be kind of fun to film myself making one of these videos. Uh, there's gonna be some VFX stuff, there's gonna be some cool camera move stuff, so I think it would be an interesting video. And I think the final product's gonna be cool, so... Let's get into it, baby! So the concept for this video is something that I've actually had for a while now, and this is the first time I'm acting on it. But basically, it's just me standing here with a pan, a pot, whatever, and it's on fire, and it's just like a slow pull-out with this on fire. I feel like it would be such an interesting, like, brash sort of image. So I have a new slider, I have a new light. We're gonna just try to slam all this together and see it looks good. First thing we're gonna set up is a slider, and basically, if you don't know what a slider is, it's two rails. I'll just set up, and I'll show you. I think I'm gonna have to go up higher, but for now, this will do. Now, I bought this 10-foot HMI cable, the micro USB or micro HMI, mini HMI. I don't know which one. They're different. Doesn't matter. I bought this 10-foot HMI cord with a mini. HMI on the one side so that it would plug into my monitor and it doesn't fit into the little slot so I can't I'm half tempted just to cut that out actually Okay, so we just blocked it. We. I just blocked it. Me and the crew one. So that when it follows the track, it'll get exactly the me, which I have to be back here now, but the right amount of distance. So we'll see how lighting that goes. But, and then the pot will be here with the fire so that it'll paint out. Cool. Another thing that has to happen is that the fire has to actually emulate fire a little bit because um, it'll be a VFX shot. I think I can do, but I also have this little guy here. I wish there was something I could. Yeah, I mean, if I get it out of frame, that'll do it. Like, it's shining where it needs to shine. Oh, but it'll be a reflection in the pot. Uh, that's a future me problem. Well, so besides being a fun little video, just for just the gigs of it, um, I'm also working on a music video. I'm in the pre-production phase of a music video, and so I want to try some things with harsh light, like hard key lighting, uh, because that's going to be sort of the vibe of the music video. And so I'm going to take this 300X and just get my Fresnel attachment and just blast it. Um, for those of you that might not know what a Fresnel lens is, it's this thing, uh, which I have attached to my LED light. Uh, the Fresnel is this glass, you see how it's like ringed? Um, and it allows you to control the light into a beam. You're gonna let us do some cool, harsh light things. Now this, of course, is when filming by yourself is uh, at its most tedious because it's just a lot of walking back and forth. Um, this is way too hot. I need to bring this down a lot. But um, what you can't see uh, probably is that this right here is caused, like, it's casting a shadow because it's on this side of uh, the table. So I'm gonna have to move it to the other side of the table so that this shadow is tucked in. I have to bring it down a lot. 
dead in that corner and it's gonna be a mess. There's a fan. I should turn the fucking fan off. Okay, and so the next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take the new light that I just got, the Amaran 100X, and I'm gonna set it up to just add an ambient light to sort of fill in everything. So we'll have the harsh light on my face, and then everything else will sort of be ambient, which would be fun. So I've just so I've just had the idea, maybe it's clever, maybe it's not, to make the wine bottle a custom label as a part of like the world building of this thing, right? That's the, the goal with uh, OPV TV, so gotta make a label. I'm also gonna put some of this on. Just give it a little bit of a shine, I think. All right, we're doing it for real this time. Okay, so now I wanna show you what it actually looks like from inside the camera. I'm shooting an S-Log3, so there's no contrast, there's no saturation, it's all really flat, and it just looks like this. And then the next step is to actually turn it into like an effects heavy shot and that requires some compositing and after effects and i'm not going to bore you with it i'm just going to show it to you this is what it looks like after i've done that and then so the final step to make it truly opb tv is to just degrade the shit out of it to make it look vhs Hold. and it's something that I've been working on for a long time like trying to finally craft finally tune a VHS look that I think actually looks real and I think I finally found one that is just this is what that looks like Thing, like why do you have to do so much stuff and then just degrade the shit out of it but it's like that's I'm gonna throw it up on the OPB TV channel if you want to head over there and watch it there's some others on there I'm sort of slowly churning them out Arclight is not reopening is it so Arclight theaters was acquired by MC which I did not know does that mean anyways thanks hinge for that piece of information I don't even remember what I'm saying, I got distracted. Oh, go check it out, go watch the other things. I feel a little more artistic when I make this, that is gonna sound stupid. I feel like it's more fulfilling artistically to make a video like that than it is to do a craft for some reason. I don't know, it's silly. Anyway, thanks for watching today's video. It's kind of a, a weird one, but subscribe, like, and you're not the droids you're looking for.